Hey, how's it going everyone? Can let's take it here and welcome back to another unboxing. It begins. The journey of the Yu-Gi-Oh! 25th anniversary set kicking off with Legendary Collection. And I've actually got not two, hang on, hang on just for the video. Three. But I actually want to keep one sealed, so we're gonna keep that one sealed. Just for collection purposes. So for this video, I'm gonna be opening two. And yeah, the day it was announced, there was a 25th anniversary set or edition coming out and re-releasing the first load of booster packs, you know, Legend of Blue Eyes, Magic Eye Spell Ruler, Metal Raiders, you know, just the booster boxes and the cards that me and many other Yu-Gi-Oh! players grew up with and I've been very excited and I couldn't wait to finally start, you know, unboxing some. So yeah, we got these ones and I just realised... We're getting Dark Crisis as well. I thought it was just going to be Legend of Blue Eyes, Metal Raiders, Spell Ruler, Ferris Servant, and Invasion of Chaos. I have not seen any news on Dark Crisis, and that's awesome. Vampire Lord's in that set. I'd be really happy to pull out a 25th anniversary edition Vampire Lord. But uh, yeah, in this box, you get one each of the, uh, the booster packs being re-released. The original Egyptian God cards, probably not tournament legal. And the trio, Blue Eyes, White Dragon, Dark Magician, Red Eyes, Black Dragon. Wish it had been the classic art. You know, the art that was in, you know, the booster packs, but that's okay, not a problem. And uh, one of those cards will be the new Quarter Century Secret Rare. Oh, very exciting. So, we'll just get that one there. And let's start opening. Cannot wait. Yeah, I haven't ordered the booster boxes yet. I actually want to wait for them to be fully released because, yeah, these are rare and they're not coming out till uh, a couple of months later. So that'll do. Like These will just be a taste, which I'm really happy about. And I'm pretty sure I actually bought this when it was the, an actual set release. And it was almost like a, a folder book, if I recall. Actually, that won't work because I can't put my cards anywhere. Open them up. I like that the card, it's almost like cards. They're all hollow. Hey, they popped out. Oh, hang on, we won't spoil. I'm gonna have to open the pack. Oh, that's all right, I've got two. I'll keep, cause yeah, I'm gonna keep one of these sealed. I, I was hoping they would be individual, but that's all right. But uh, yeah, there's definitely a quarter century rare in the back. So we'll just get everything out first. Lay it all out. Any secrets under the box? So you got a nice deck box, really cool. Actually, hmm, might do that actually. Oh, I want to do the booster packs. Sorry, I'm, I'm a bit, I'm excited. I mean, I don't know what to do for the best, because man, I can't believe we're going to be opening up some Legend of Blue Eyes, Metal Raiders, Ruler, <laughs> Ferris Servant, Dark Crisis, Invasion of Chaos. Can I? I can. Oh, it takes me back when I finally started opening all my booster boxes and got that really nice fake Legend of Blue <laughs> box. Jazz, I can't believe that's almost been 10 years. Might save that to the end. No, I'll do it now. So the quarter century rare is on the back. So what I'll do, put that one there for now. So, Obelisk the Tall Mentor. Very nice. Slife of the Sky Dragon, 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 my favorite Egyptian god. It's even got the, <laughs> this card cannot be used in a duel. Doreen Dragon, hurrah. Blue Eyes, White Dragon, Dark Magician, Red Eyes, Black Dragon. Very nice. Oh, it takes me back. These are my cards right here. Right, and there's the super duper secret rare. Blue Eyes White Dragon, or Slife of the Sky Dragon, and I'll be happy with. Oh, Dark Magician! Oh, that is gorgeous! Oh, I like that. You know what I'm gonna do? I wanna get every card. See, I didn't wanna just buy six of these boxes, because. I mean, you're going to get so many of the, the preset Egyptian God cards and Blue Eyes, Dark Magician, and. Uh, red eyes, so I'm just gonna buy these separately. Oh, that's very nice. I love that Prudel Before we continue we got to get this. 
Oh, I'm loving that. Gorgeous. Oh, I'll lay her down for now. And uh, I'll do the god cards while I'm here as well. Oh, it's got the coloured backing as well. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Nice touch. Too, I'm surprised I haven't done more of this. Like, the coloured backs. You know, one in every thousand boxes, someone gets the rare card that's got a different coloured back. Wonder what the pull rate for these booster packs are. Do you get, you know, maybe three of the packs gets a guaranteed uh, holo? Alright, that's all them sleeved. Uh, I might go back to front. We're going to kick off with the Invasion of Chaos. Technically, I'm still yet to unbox an actual Invasion of Chaos box. The one that I did was a fake, unfortunately. Oh, I'm still spewing about that. It was too good to be true with how cheap it was. Alright, let's have a look. Oh, Curse Seal, the Forbidden Spell. Shot Man, the Desperate Outlaw. Soul Tiger. Oh, I had that card a lot because there's such a strong defense for a level 4. Uh, Mad Dog of Darkness. We will destroy it! Oh, yes! Oh, that was one of the cards that I wanted to pull out of that fake box. Nice! Oh, what a great start. Gower Lizard. Griffin's Feather Duster. Harvey's Feather Duster spin-off. Spartial Collapse. Terror Rogue. Terror King Salmon. 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 <laughs> I'm speechless. I can't believe I just pulled out. Strike Ninja. He was one of the you know, one of the cars that I wanted to pull. Man, what a... <laughs> a bit of a, um... A reward for me. There you go, you get your Strike Ninja. Oh, that's great. I'm so happy about that. That... Is getting a gold sleeve. That's going in my treasured box. Oh my god, I can't believe I just pulled out Strike Ninja. Ah! Oh, that's so cool. Nice. Oh, I'm all excited now. Vampire Lord, come on. So I wonder if the booster boxes are going to be the first edition. I mean, you can tell this is a re-release set because you just look at the year date, obviously. And uh, the TV Tokyo Konami wasn't always there. Goblin Agreed. Morale Boost. Uh, Sakurisu Armor. Really good card. I always had that one as well. Arc Fiend's Oath. Skill Drain. Suzuki Samurai 2. Or Sasuke. Kel Kelbik. Fairy of the Spring. Contract with Exodia. Oh, Exodia Necros is in this as well. Alrighty, so the the drops are pretty low. Which is good. I like that. Alright, Ferris Servant. Um, I forgot it was Arthur. No, um, Destiny Board was uh, Labyrinth of Nightmare. Oh, I wish Labyrinth of Nightmare had made the cut. Uh, Gurushin Kiwagana DNA Surgery. Oh, that's a deadly card that Luke always used on me. Cyber Falcon. Oh, this was one of my first cards I ever owned. And this was actually Luke's first ever card. I remember when he bought it off a friend in our group. Paid like a dollar. Huh? This card is not treated as a cyber card. Oh, because of the cyber dragons. There's a lot of cards used as a cyber. Oh. What's wrong with Cyber Falcon? See, I love when the art looks so beast. I mean, it's like Beast Wars. Respect play. Skull Invitation. Jinzo! It's a secret rare! Oh, I'm getting the secret rares. I, th I think Strike Ninja was. No, I don't think so. Oh, Luke. Jinzo's his favourite card. I'm going to have to get him to get one. One of these. Inspection, Ground Collapse, oh, I used to, uh, the Ajama deck, use three of these, it's really deadly. World Suppression. Oh, oh. I'm definitely getting the booster boxes. I just wanted to wait, because I thought it's going to be too good to be true. You know, you get the booster boxes and everyone's going to be really mad, because it's not what it's, you know, cracked up to be, but, oh my god. As soon as they are released, I'm getting them. I see, I've, I did these in case I do miss out, so at least I can say, you know, I've 
done it. Oh, that's cool. That gets a gold sleeve as well. <laughs> Spell ruler. Um, I forgot what's in this. Uh, relinquished, obviously. But I forgot the big cards in this one. I think the XYZ metal... Um, XYZ dragon cannons in this one. I didn't want to do too much research, even though I've done these boxes before. I want to be surprised. And we start with Tyhone 2. Electric Snake. Final Destiny, man. There's been a few players that I had that would use this card, and it's so risky. Crab Turtle, one of my favorite rituals. I remember when I got the one of the tins and I got the Crab Turtle and the ritual card. I used it in my deck. Giant Germ, even used this quite a bit. Missile Plasma Zone, used that for my zombies. Gaia Power. Twin Long Rods 2. Giant Turtle who feeds on flames. Oh, did I, um... Yeah, that was my rare, Giant Germ. Oh, I'm just looking at these cards. It takes me back. Oh, I miss those days. I actually really want to play a, um... Or replay a classic Yu-Gi-Oh game and do a playthrough. I want to do that, um, World Championship 2006 where it was just, it was... You were going through the entire week doing things, like dueling people, and then there was tournaments. It's one of the best Yu-Gi-Oh games on the Game Boy Advance. Black Skull Dragon, Summon Skull, Gate Guardian, and oh, there was another card. I think Meteor Black Dragon, I think. Really nice cards in this one. I hope we get them. I hope we get something. Actually, how the backs look. Yeah, the backs look pretty crisp. Some sets, you know, it's like it always peels on the corner. He's so be Petit Moth, Armored Zombie, Musician King, Princess of Chirigiri, King of Yamamakai, Ground Attacker Burgroth, Killer Needle, Hibikimi. Come on, come on. Blue Eyes White Dragon, Dark Magician, Red Eyes Black Dragon, Exodia. Guy of the Dragon Champion, Guy of the Fierce Knight, Curse of Dragon. Come on. Forest. Silver bow and arrow. Yurabi. Legendary sword. Yashub in the Fire Knight. Damn Furious Sea King. Succubus Knight, one of my favorite cards that I just always used when I had such a basic deck. Dissolve Rock. Rain Temperature. Alrighty. First box. Oh. Not bad at all. We got the Legendary Jinzo and Strike Ninja. Very awesome card. and It just reminds me of Dungeon Dice Monsters because he was such a big card in that uh, series of episodes. And... We still got one more, so we've still got a chance to pull something, you know, like a blue eyes or vampire lord would be cool. Oh, can I? I don't want to open it. I'll just see what I've got. Hang on. Oh, oh, oh. red eyes by dragon. Nice. So yeah, I'm gonna keep that one sealed just for collection. Uh, I won't line up the pack, uh, the packs this time. I'll just get to it. Uh, we'll do it again. Vasion of Chaos. God, that was messy. Hyper Hammerhead. Coach Goblin. Yukoki! I used to use this a lot during my first days of the zombie deck that I bought, uh, built. Zero Gravity. Linguga. Cannonball Spear Shellfish. Ajama Yellow, Prickle Fairy, Crimson Ninja, Vampire Lord, come on. Oh, and I think Dark Magician Girl is in this as well. Or is that, um, Magic Ruler, or Spell Ruler? Battle Footballer, Agito, Sakuritsu Armor, Indescent Ordeal, 
Wicked, Breaking, Flame Bridge. But I do it with Dark Ruler. Dark Scorpion, Manet, the Thorn, Kilda. Ooh, okay. Nothing yet. Ferris Servant. Uh, yeah, I can't really recall anything else. I think, you know, Jinzo, and that's about it. Skull Marina. Thousand Eyes Idol. Type Zero Magic Crusher. Dark Fire Soldier 1, a really powerful level 4 at the time. Life Force Sword. Burning Land. Oh! Darika Yaiba. Dark Bat. Gradius! Little Easter egg right there of the game. Really cool card. Oh boy. Uh, three packs left. <laughs> I think Time Magician Girl is in uh, Spell Ruler. <gasps> Ryu Yu! Ryuran, I mean. The Reliable Guardian, it was. Hamburger recipe, give me the hamburger. Yuri Umiruka. Shining Angel. Painful choice. Oh, man. So I'm going to get something else. Oh, well. Darkness approaches. Commencement stance. Curse of Fiend. Oh, man. Mm. See, at this time, you weren't really wanting Spell Hollows. You wanted the cool cards. It's not really a, you know, had good card to even use. Whereas a draw 10 cards, choose one to go in the graveyard and discard the others. Is that right? Select card, five cards from your deck, showing your opponent. Your opponent selects one card among them. Add that to your hand, discard the remaining. Oh, geez. No wonder it's called Painful Choice. Just a yellow sleeve for you. Okie doke. Metal Raiders, Legend of Lies. Come on. You can give me something good. We kick off with Lava Battle Guard. Give me Swamp. Guardian of the Labyrinth. Uguchi. There's Swamp Battle Guard. Nice. Sangin. Share the pain. Kojikosi. Rainbow Flower. Disc Magician. Oh, come on. I could feel the blue eyes. Steroga Grotto 1. Terror the Terrible. Ah, uh, Mile. Petit Dragon. Flame Ghost. Come on, come on, come on! Oh, man. Violet Crystal. Sogan. Or Sogan, I always said. Man Eater. Frenzied Panda. Wow. Okay, so this is another reason I didn't want to go so crazy with these boxes, because, yeah, $60 a pop, and, I mean, you get the really cool, you know, this pack right here, but, whew, look at that drop from two boxes, but in saying that, we got two nice pulls. We got the Jinzo and the Strike Ninja, which I was always a big fan of. I love Strike Ninja, and, yeah, that Jinzo is very nice, and... Got some nice retro cards for the collection, like back in my day of Yu-Gi-Oh, you know, the God cards, Dark Magician, Blue Eyes, Red Eyes, and a very nice new rare, rarity type, I should say. That's really cool. I like that mosaic look. Very nice. And that's an end to this unboxing. I'll tell you what, everyone, I really enjoyed this. I, I'm all in now. I'm, as soon as... The, uh, the booster boxes get a, like they are released. I will get my hands on them and start doing unboxings for them. But until then, thank you all for watching and I will see you all later. Alrighty, sticker time. It's been a while. Alright, what should we do? I think we've got a bit of room to squeeze a couple of more. Alright, I'm doing this one because if I can get it in there, it's going to be perfect. Lightsaber! Ah, Elegon, got a lightsaber now! Run! Ah, why not? Give him a hat too! Smashing!